now to a boxer ready to take his second chance with both hands. Anthony Crawler fights Colombia's lightweight world champion Darlis Perez on Saturday in a much-anticipated rematch at the Manchester Arena. Yes, Crawler's second shot comes after many thought that he won the original fight in the summer, only for the judge's decision to be given as a draw. He didn't lose, as we said a moment ago. It was a draw, so he feels it's unfinished business. Not only that, of course, he'd come back after being attacked and injured by burglars a year ago. So, as Richard Ascombe explained, he is now more determined than ever, and once again in this report, there is some flash photography. No more chances, and no more Mr. Nice Guy. Anthony's been told in no uncertain terms, we need the bad guy out of Anthony Crawler for this fight. It's in him, and he's got to bring it out of him. Last time we hurt Dallas Perez and let him off the hook. We've got to go in there and finish the job and not leave nothing to the judges. It was pretty hard to take, but I had to take the positives from the night as well, and I got to box in front of a packed out arena, in, in an arena that I've been going to since I was a little kid. Watching the greats of British boxing fighting for a world title, so it was a dream come true for me, so I had to be thankful as well, so that helped me get over it very quickly. Anthony has certainly been through a lot, serious injury and desperate disappointment, and is more determined than ever to realise his boyhood dream. How will you feel if you win that world title? Yeah, it'll, it'll all be worth it. It's, um, you say everything happens for a reason, and it's all put, you know, obstacles are put in our way, but overcome them and become world champion on Saturday. It'll be um, a childhood dream come true. A dream I've had since first lacing on a pair of gloves at the age of 10. A year ago, we sat underneath by the Christmas tree, leg in plaster, thought his career was over. This year, he could be sat there, world champion, and under the Christmas tree, it'll be a fantastic achievement. Listen, him being a Manchester boy, me being a Manchester boy, don't get much better than that, does it? How confident are you you'll do it? I'm very confident. It's no, no way complacent, but I felt I'd done enough last time to win it. I believe I've improved and I go in there now with even more confidence. I'm really confident on Saturday night I'll become world champion and realise that dream. Something that for the man they call million dollar crawler would be simply priceless. Richard Ascombe, BBC Northwest tonight. We wish him well.